Welcome back to our channel. So in today's session, we'll discuss one more command in Linux that is compare command. So first of all, let us open the Ubuntu. So how to install this Ubuntu in Windows 10? I have recorded the session, so I will share the link in the description so that you can follow that and you can use the Ubuntu in Windows 10. Now we'll create a two different files with the content. F1.txt is the first file. Let me create the content. I will create a numbers 10, 20, 30, 40, and 50. Then I will create one more file f2.txt with the numbers 30, 40, 50, 60, and 70. So we are having the files. Let us check the content f1.txt and cat f2.txt right so this is the content 10 20 30 40 50 are the content of f1 and 30 40 50 60 70 are the content of f2 now we are supposed to compare the content of two different files so for that purpose we are going to use a command called comm compare right comm f1.txt space f2.txt so it always gives the three columns as a result. It will give the three columns as a result. So let me explain with an Excel. So let us take the Excel and I will tell you about that thing. So the file one dot txt is having the values 10, 20 and 50. And file two dot txt, we are having the content from 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, right, so, right, now, if you compare these things, if you compare these things, then it will return the result in three columns. It will return the result in three different columns. See, the result. This is the result. Let us let uh, let us assume this is the result, right? So it will return in three different columns. The first column, the first column, it will return non-matching items of file 1 so it will display the non matching items of file 1 the first column and the second column it will display the non matching items of file 2 non matching items of file 2 and the third one the third one represents matching items matching items from both the files right so this is the result for this is the result for comparing two different file content right so if you observe if you compare this one you can see the non matching items of file 1 over file 2 so 10 and 20 here it will, it will display 10 and 20 right and non matching item of file 2 so non matching item of file 2 that is 60 and 70 60 and 70 and match, third column is a matching items from both the files matching items from both the files that is 30 40 50 so 30 40 50 so this will be the result of comparison method or command comparison command right so it the result if you compare two different files the first column it will always return in the three columns first column will re represent the uh, non-matching items of file one 
second one non matching items of file 2 and the third one matching items of both the files you can observe here the same so the first one is a non matching items of file 1 the second column non matching items of file 2 third column matching items of file and if you want to represent a single column then there is a code called minus 23 or hyphen 23 f1.txt f2.txt it will return only the non matching items of file 1 if you use hyphen 23 it will return only the non matching items of file 1 and if you use hyphen 13 it will return the non matching items of file 2 and if you use 1 2 it will return the matching items of both the files so if you if you use only the comm command it will the result will be in three columns and if you want to represent the same in a single columns use hyphen 23 hyphen 13 and hyphen 1 2 so by using this command comm command we can compare the content of two different files or a strings right so hope you understood this one so if you really enjoyed my session like my session share my session with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to our channel thanks for watching thank you very much